roaches are killing rhinos for their horns. They are worth 1.2 million rand for one horn. Today our Grade 3 class hosted a wildlife awareness convention. The seals can be as small as a peanut or as big as a parrot. They eat anything with flesh and bone. Should you find yourself surrounded by a pack of wolves, you should look at their body language. My name is Gail Loveland and I'm the Grade 3 teacher here at Helderberg Primary School. We run an annual convention with our Grade 3 class. In all my years of teaching, I've never known kids who haven't fallen passionately in love with animals, especially when they're threatened or endangered. So we encourage the children to find an animal that's on the endangered species list, whether it's critical or vulnerable, and today was no exception. The children rose to the occasion, researched the animal topics, and presented not only a few interesting facts about the animals, but also highlighted why it's an endangered species. And there is no international law that protects the white lion from being wiped off the face of the earth. What we can do to try and stop this situation from worsening. Help save endangered species by joining IFOR, visiting wildlife parks regularly and help fund projects for endangered animals. And it also gives the children an opportunity to expand their horizons. A few months ago, Gail Loveland, the Deputy Principal of Haldeberg Primary School, sent me an email requesting our animal action material. <laughs> I posted it off to her and I got a reply back a week later saying that she was very impressed with the materials and that they run a conservation awareness convention with their grade three learners every year. Having used the Tiger DVD. Tigers are amongst the most charismatic and majestic animals on our planet. It was clear that there were four basic areas that were covered and that's what made it so easy to introduce the topic this year on a more structured scale so that the kids had parameters in which to work in. The materials which we forwarded onto Gail, she used that with the learners to directly encourage them to research and investigate the different species which they had chosen to speak on. And I think we fulfilled far more that way than having simply done too many interesting facts and none of the realities about the endangerment that the animal faces. Illegal hunters that are called poachers are still killing elephants for their ivory tusks. We thought it would be a great opportunity to attend and to chat to the learners and to the educators and to the parents about our Animal Action Education Program. Today was very exciting, but I was a little bit nervous. I was a little nervous, my legs are shaking. But when I got up to say my speech, then my mom was there, so I wasn't that nervous. I like um, Jenna's. The seahorse eats mainly shrimp, which it sucks in through its tube like mouth, like my brother. <laughs> what did he speak about? The, the crocodilian alligator. Crocodiles and alligators make a big family called crocodilians. The research was very scientific. Lifespan. The brain links lives up to about 13 years. Annually we distribute 500 packs of materials throughout South Africa to educators and we have over 200,000 learners being exposed to the materials every year. I really like this little tiger and the pencil case but I also really like this pencil. Why do you like it so much? Because it reminds me of today. <laughs> 